This reading is for my Aries, my beautiful Aries. I want to say thank you to all my subscribers, all my new subscribers. Welcome. If you haven't already hit that bell button, hit that bell button at the bottom so you can get a notification each time I upload. The first card out we have is the devil. So, the devil could mean a lot of things. It could mean codependency, it could mean fear, it could mean confusion, illusion. Okay, we have the Knight of Wands. And then we have the Ten of Cups. What we have under the bottom, the chariot. Okay, so right from the jump, I'm picking up on the energy of you guys could have been dealing with someone who was a player, someone who was non-committal, someone who was very toxic, someone who, you know, put you in the energy or confused you, you know, a lot of times. Um, I'm also picking up on the energy with the chariot. Okay, I'm also picking up on the energy of somebody that's in regret. I'm getting a five of cups in my third eye. Um, someone could definitely be looking at you different. It could be seeing you as the Ten of Cups. They could be seeing you as someone who's, you know, wish fulfillment. Someone that they could see themselves living a, you know, a beautiful life with you. This is, um, Capricorn Cancer energy here, Sagittarius energy here. Um, someone could definitely have been in a, um, a toxic, 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 um, energy before. Um, someone is definitely realizing coming from the devil to the night of ones and ten of cups. Somebody could be realizing that their toxic weeds um could have definitely um kept them um from this connection, but they see you as the ten of cups. So it's like somebody is realizing that they play away, somebody is realizing that their toxicity, somebody realizing that how much they played the major part when it came to you guys' connection that um you know it confused you. And it also um it left this person in a lot of regret. I'm getting a five of cups in my third eye. So I am keep hearing. So this person could be in a lot of regret right now because this is how they see you. They see you as a ten of cups. With the chariot being here with the queen of pentacles, this is somebody that wants to come towards you. Um, this person could definitely see you as someone who they will, who they will, um, wouldn't mind giving a commitment to. Um, I feel like it's just something about this person's energy. Oh, excuse me. That was a spirit bird. Said about this person, energy could be passed. Um, this person realizing they play a ways they didn't get them anywhere because the one who they actually love, the one who they see as the Ten of Cups, um, you know, you guys can you not know, not be there anymore. Somebody realizing they play a ways and get them no damn where. Holy Spirit, give me some more messages, please and thank you. This could be somebody that you share kids with. This could be somebody, if you don't share kids or you can't bear kids at this time, this could be someone who sees themselves, you know, who has seen themselves having children with you, okay? Or this could be just someone that sees you as, a, like, you know, very motherly, like that motherly energy, very nurturing, very loving and caring. You guys, I don't know who that's for. I could be, um, somebody could be really receiving a lot of, um, gifts you know a lot of you guys could be i don't know somebody could be ordering a lot of stuff at this time could be receiving a lot of um packages i don't know where that came from okay so take it how it resonates but somebody is hurt yeah whoever this person has hurt they could be definitely want to move towards you Holy Spirit, give me some more messages please and thank you let me just straighten this thank you Maybe you guys are getting things, getting ready for Christmas, you know, for the ones who celebrate it. Maybe you guys are redecorating your home. So we have a few cards that came out. We had the Three of Cups. Yeah, so you guys could be um, in this energy of celebration, you know, just getting ready for your home, getting ready for the holidays. But I'm, I'm picking up on the energy of someone who was very toxic that's reminiscent about you, that wants to reconcile with you. Someone miss celebrating with you. Someone wishing that they can be a part of you when it, um, you know, with these upcoming holidays, we have the five of pentacles. So this could definitely, um, be an energy of someone, um, who's feeling rejected. Someone who's feeling left out in the cold. Um, but with the nine of wands being here, it just giving me an energy of someone is, um, this is someone that knows, um, it was very aware of what they did to you. We have the king of pentacles here. Okay. So this is someone that's very aware of, you know, what the, what the pain and, 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 and her trauma that they have caused with the King of Pentacles being here. Someone is wishing that they would have given you the commitment that you deserve. Okay. 
because this person is going from a knight to a king of pinnacles. So this person is definitely, um, I feel like within this separation, this person definitely had a time to think. This person definitely could have matured a lot, okay, when it came to, um, you know, just how they move in life, how they do things. Somebody is definitely growing up with the Ten of Cups being here. Somebody is realizing, like, dang. You know, I really see Mystic Sunflower Collective Sunseeds as the person that I, you know, is my, you know, wish fulfillment. You know, I can have, you know, everything with, you know, with this big old rainbow being here. Like, it's like I can have a successful um, connection with this person, with the three of cups being here. This is somebody that just given me intuitively is that I miss, you know, being around you. I miss celebrating with you. I miss hanging out with you. And this is not a relationship. This could just be, uh, you know, it could be a friend, family, whoever, take it how it resonates. But I'm picking heavily up on a, a relationship. This also could be friends that just missing out, you know, um, feeling, you know, left out in the cold by you. They could feel like, you know, you guys have moved on, you know, surpassed um, every adversity that you've been through. And somebody could also just see you doing very well for yourself in life. So take it how it resonates. I'm getting a few downloads. Spirit, give me a card on the devil. The, the nine of cups want to come out. So this person can be constantly drinking a lot or this person can just see you as they wish fulfillment. This is somebody that want to work on things with you. Holy Spirit. What is the devil? Please and thank you. Okay. So Spirit gave me two. So we have the page of wands and three of swords. Okay. So it can be a Capricorn energy. Take it how it resonates. But somebody who wants to reach out to you, um, this person that wants to, you know, uh, speak to you, I feel like they're going to come from a very hurt place, meaning to where whatever they communicate with you, this person is going to let you know that I understand the pain that I have caused you. I understand that my play of ways didn't get me nowhere. I understand your worth now. I understand who you are to me now. And I just wish that we can, you know, we can do things. You know, I don't, I don't want to be out in the cold no more. I don't, I don't want to be apart from you no more. Um, I feel real lonely. You know, I, I, I feel, you know, like. I don't, you know, I'm missing something out. I, I feel like I'm out in the cold. I feel like I'm missing something. And I know I have caused this, you know, this pain to myself. And then I watch you and I, and I see you doing your thing on your own. Somebody wrongfully judge you. Somebody wants to come to you with some type of communication. But I feel like this person is going to come from a, a heart that's broken. But I, I don't see this. I don't see any swords out here. But I feel like um, somebody is in their head. And somebody is coming from a point of where they want to speak some type of truth to you. Okay. Somebody knows the pain that they have caused you. Spirit, give me a card on the Knight of Wands. Holy Spirit, please and thank you. Period. I cannot make it up to you. Period. Nine of Cups. They know you are their wish fulfillment. Okay? They know you are with the Empress. Somebody recognize who you are. Who you are. And they are in major regret. Somebody is like, I wish for somebody like you. Only to get you into fumble with. You understand? Only to get you into fumble with. Somebody was in a very, very low vibrational energy at some point in their life. And and whether you want to uh, hear this or not, some seeds, I feel like from the night, somebody is somebody is realizing that. Somebody is growing the hell up. I feel like you was a catalyst to this person, you know, growth. You, you you made some type of impact or some type of change in this person. Seven of Cups. This person is all in their mind, all in their head when they think about it. Somebody realizing that that player that player that player ways ain't get me nowhere. I can have a whole bunch of options, but what's a bunch of options? What's a bunch of knights, page, and queens to the empress? You can't even compare. You can't even compare. Somebody wants to come towards you and reconcile. Somebody wants to come out the cold because with the seven of cups, it's just giving me somebody is constantly in their mind, constantly thinking them about, you know, what they have done to you, how they have mistreated you, how they play these kitty, 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 kitty games. You know, someone that's coming in on some lustful energy when you really the ten of cups to them, nine of cups to them. Somebody also could be indulging in some type of substance, you know, to try to numb the pain. But they see you as the empress. 
Yeah, they all in their head. They all in their head about this Ace of Pentacles that they want to offer you. Give me a card on the Three of Cups, Holy Spirit. Please and thank you. This person could not be doing so well financially. Somebody see how protected you are? Ace of Cups. Mm. This person got a lot of love for you. A lot of love for you. Six of Wands under the bottom. This person wants to, um, this person wants another chance. Somebody wants a new beginning with you. What's the, the love is in reverse. I feel like this is you guys' energy. You guys have held back when it came to, like, you know, sexual, um, giving any type of attention to this person. You just like, no. I'm hearing, do you remember the times when you told me you love me? This person is stuck on what you said in the past. I don't see the Six of Cups out here, but somebody is stuck on what you said in the past. And they hold on to that so tight. But when it was in their play of ways, they were just running there and, and doing the most. But now that somebody is sitting, they could be a hermit. Now that somebody is sitting somewhere still, somebody realizing who their true love is. But with the Five of Pentacles and the love is in reverse, I feel like you guys walked away, Sunseeds. You guys are not beef for this energy. You guys are not in the, the love is in reverse. I'm, that means I'm not entertaining it. I'm not giving no energy to that. I'm not giving my body, my mind, my soul, or none of that to that. Mm. Yeah, four wands with the five of swords. Somebody feeling de real defeated at this time. King of wands. What's the King of Wands, Holy Spirit? What's the King of Wands, Holy Spirit? Thank you, Holy Spirit. Ace of Swords. Somebody is speaking some type of truth. And my nose itching. Somebody could be speaking some type of truth to someone that they probably don't want to hear it, but I'm hearing this, the truth that this person is speaking and this could be you, Sunseeds. I'm hearing it's so sweet and clear. So you could have basically communicated with this person and you could have came from a place where it was sweet, it was clear, but it was the honest, it was your honest truth of how you're going to move forward. Mm. I'm telling you, Sunseeds, how you're going to move forward. The world card, something is over. Six of Pentacles with the Seven of Swords. Somebody is not given to something that they feel like is toxic. Somebody who's a liar. Someone who's not to be trusted. Four Cups. Somebody is uninterested in whatever this is. Damn. Give me a card on the lovers and mirrors, Holy Spirit. Somebody is madly in love with you. The love is in reverse, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Holy Spirit. The chariot. Somebody who you're not interested in giving, giving nothing to. This person wants to come towards you. I can't make it up. The chariot and the ace of pentacles. This person wants to come towards you and offer you something. But I feel like a lot of you guys have moved forward with your life. Okay? You guys are, are, are very chosen. Okay? Mm. I feel like the divine has blessing you for all the pain and the suffering that you have been through. But with the loves in reverse and the chariot, cancer energy with the ace of pentacles, whoever this person that's madly in love with you, somebody is coming towards you to bring you an offer. And there's some type of truth that this person wants to speak to you. This person could be wanting to be honest and let you know, you know, I was a player. I did have options, you know? I, I, I honestly, with the Ten of Cups being here, I'm, I'm getting the Three of Wands. I thought you was going to wait. I thought you was going to wait. You move forward with your life. And I'm like, how did you do it? How did you, how did you gracefully bow out? I miss celebrating with you. I miss hanging out with you. I miss chatting with you. I miss building with you. For some of you guys, I'm hearing you the only one that listened to me. Wow. Somebody really wants to be with you. Spirit, give me a card on the three of swords, please and thank you.
Mm. We have the Emperor in reverse. Somebody who overdid their control with the shrimp card. Okay, Aries, Leo energy is out here. Libra, Taurus energy is out here. Gemini energy is out here. Taurus energy is out here. Um, someone, um, a Libra energy out here. Someone overdid their control. They did. They did. They just thought they was. They just. I mean, they thought they had it in the bag. Some seeds. They thought they had it in the bag. But somebody didn't know how strong you were. Somebody didn't know how much you had so much love for yourself. With this three of swords and the emperor reversing the shrimp, it's like I just knew. Wow, I just knew you had a good heart. I I I, I played it easy. I played this safe because I knew you had a good heart. But somebody didn't know how much you really love yourself too. How much self-love you have for yourself. How much confidence you have in yourself. How how courageous you are. How brave you are. Actually, just how strong you are. Some of you guys didn't even know your strength until the situation occurred in your life. A lot of you guys, you knew you were strong, but you just didn't know how strong you were. Okay. So we have divine counterparts out here. One person just in a high vibrational energy. Um, you know what side you on. Take it how it resonates. One person just in a high vibrational energy where the spirit is blessing this person with um, multiple beautiful um, opportunities, um, blessings in their life. And then there's someone with the emperor in reverse that is um, actually receiving karma for how they played with you, how they fumbled you, how they lied to you, how they was in this play of energy and thinking... You know, because they know how Mystic Sunflower Collective Sun Seed's heart was, somebody felt like they had enough time to be a player. Mm. Hi, friend. Taurus energy. Yeah. Somebody was somebody was stuck. Somebody was is is, is somebody was stuck in some old outdated beliefs. Maybe this person um could have um was raised by a mom or father or aunt figure or grandmother. Take it how it resonates. You know, they could have watched um, their parent or their grandmother or their aunt go through things in a relationship. And they could have um, watched that the um, whoever raised them, the other significant other, you know, um, was, you know, you know, stayed around, you know, allowed them to do whatever. Or maybe whoever they was raised by, thank you, son, I mean, I'm sorry. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Whoever they was raised by could have, um, you know, waited while this other person, whoever they was dating, just do them any kind of way. Somebody, I'm just picking up, with, you know, very um, heavily with the hyphen. Somebody was definitely stuck on some traditional, outdated beliefs. And they could have looked at you and think that because you had a good heart. Um, I don't see the queen of cups out here, but somebody could have looked at you like you was naive, sun seeds. You know, thought that you was going to be there. But you done stepped it up like 10, 10 notches. And somebody's in a lot of regret. But this person was stuck with some old, outdated beliefs. That's just not who you are. But maybe they was raised that way to watch their mother, their grandmother, their aunt, somebody get treated, you know, poorly. And just think that that was how a woman or a man was supposed to be treated and they'll be around. But so, with the five of cups and the higher friend, somebody was very disappointed. Somebody realized whatever they believe you to be, mm -mm, you was the totally opposite. Somebody didn't know how strong you were. Ace of Wands. Brand new beginning. A lot Ace of Wands with the three of Pentacles and the star. A lot of you guys have, um, you know, moved on to new jobs, um, started new um, endeavors in your life. You got, a lot of you guys have got promotions. Where you now you being recognized, people are applauding you, celebrating you. Okay. A lot of you guys have definitely started something new when it comes to the workplace. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Spirit, give me a card on the um on the higher front, please, and thank you. can't make it up to you, son. See, I'm telling you, whatever they believe or whatever how they was raised to believe that this is how a relationship or this is how um, a connection is supposed to be, somebody is very apologetic because you showed this person, I'm not that. 
I am not that. I don't know what you planned on, what you thought I was, or what your beliefs were. But I, be, I love myself. That's why we have the strength card. I love myself. I have confidence. I always been strong. Just because I'm coming up as the empress and I'm loving and I'm, and I'm compassionate and I'm caring and I'm understanding doesn't mean because I get that out, I don't have that for myself. The empress gave that to herself before she can give that out to you. It takes a lot. It takes a lot to get to that empress energy. And she had to get, she or he, take out Resley, had to get that to herself or his self before they can ever get that out to the public. Somebody's a star or will be. Or someone just has a healing energy. But first they had to get that to themselves before they can get that out. So how dare, how dare this person think that you didn't get that to yourself first before you get that out. Somebody slap on you. Somebody slap on you. Somebody slap on somebody. I'm hearing that special love. Special love. You got a very special love. Yeah, you come up as an empress and upright. You very authentic. You don't need to sugarcoat nothing of nobody. You don't need to front of faith nothing of nobody. When you show up, that's who you are. And you stand on that shit ten toes down. Somebody very apologetic. The higher friends clarify with the page of cards. I can't, I can't, listen, baby. I can't make this up to you. Not a pinnacle. Somebody is very apologetic to this person. They see how independent you are. Self-sufficient. Hard-working. Self-made. Got it out the mud. How you could do this with or without them. Yeah, it was cute. I mean, every year it was cute. I wanted you. But I ain't never need you. I wanted you because I wanted you. But I ain't need you. Somebody like your smile. I'm here. Somebody got a big smile. I'm here. How can I resist someone like you? So I don't see the queen of wands. Oh, okay. I see the king of wands out here. Something about you is, is like irresistible. Give me a card on the five of pentacles, Holy Spirit. Five of Pentacles, please and thank you, Holy Spirit. Five of Pentacles with the Seven of Wands. You're very, you, 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 you're protective towards your energy, towards this person who you put out. Wow, well, wow, okay. So you could have put this person out. Maybe I kicked them out. I'll take it how it resonates. But if this is somebody that left you out in the cold and now that they want to return, you have set boundaries up to this energy. You're very, you, you're very much in the energy of protecting your energy from this person. Hermit, Virgo energy. Justice, Libra energy. Somebody who has, you know, doing a lot of self-reflecting. And it just, and within that time of them thinking, going from a knight to a king, Somebody is definitely reflected and somebody feels like they owe you justice. They owe you justice. Somebody can't shake the fact that you are the Ten of Cups. They can't. They have many options. Many options. But just nobody compared to you. I'm hearing the way you light this person's life up, you would never even believe it. Something about somebody's smile. Somebody got a big, beautiful smile. I don't know. Somebody got a big, beautiful smell. Sarah, give me a card on the Emperor Reverse. Please and thank you. I heard magnifying it. Somebody got a big old beautiful smell. Spirit, what's the Emperor Reverse? I'm hearing the sun is to shine again with your... Yeah, I'm telling you. The Emperor in Reverse is clarified with the Hermit. I cannot make this up to you. Aries Virgo energy. Somebody, whoever this Emperor is in Reverse that did... Over, try to overdo their control because they knew the type of heart. I'm hearing the type of heart that you had. Somebody is going within. Somebody is going within. They're doing some self-reflecting. They're investigating some 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 type of investigation. But I feel like it, 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 this investigation has everything to do everything to do with this person's self. Everything has to do with self. So so. 
Like, damn, I really came at this empress in, in the devil in the night of horns energy? How could I when they had my ten of cups? They got everything I possibly could have ever wanted in a man or a woman. Mmm. Mm, mm, mm. Give me a card on the night of Holy Spirit. You can't even imagine how this person is feeling right now. But whoever your person is, son, see, be that I'm the vessel, I can feel the energy. Nine of Wands, Two of Pentacles, going back and forth in their head. This person was unbalanced. This person was unbalanced, juggling, going back and forth in their head. Give me another card of the Two of Pentacles and the Nine of Wands. I'm here and I fumbled. I fumbled you. Ten of Wands, it's hard on them. It's hard on this person knowing. Like, damn. But I'm but for some man, I, I'm getting excited because I, I know what's I I know what's up, so I see I can feel it intuitively. This person is this person did not do right by you. But one thing with this high from being here, okay? This Empress being here. The ember in reverse. Spirit hit someone's value. Because spirit felt like this person was on. They was going to fumble you anyway. So spirit, because everybody had free will. One thing I like about, you know, Holy Spirit and Divine, they're not going to take their free will from you. They allow you to do whatever you choose. But I showed you. Somebody, somebody was shown who you were. But somebody, somebody just thought because you had this good heart. You would just wait. You would just wait. So spirit hit your value. Spirit started lessening and lessening. Like spirit started hitting your value even more and more and more. To where they couldn't see that at all. So spirit said, go out and do whatever you do. And now somebody in her me reflecting like, damn. And it's hard on them. It's hard on them. Because somebody realized... I literally had it. I had my love of my life. The magician with the sun. Mm. Eight of swords. Two of cups. I can't make it up to you. I'm trying to manifest a new beginning because they want the happiness. All in their head. They want this two of cups. Overthinking. How the hell did I, how did, I'm hearing, how did I, like, how did I mess this up? Somebody is definitely in isolation thinking a lot. Knight of Pentacles. <laughs> Some of them felt like they took too long. Four wands. Someone who I, I feel like I can have the, the, the marriage with, the commitment with. Someone I can hold close with every night and, and, and that I know is loyal, sincere. Somebody's seeing things at a higher perspective. And right now they feeling in the five of swords. They feeling real defeated with the two of wands because of the choices that they made. But the fool card. Somebody wants a brand new beginning. Let me see something. Let me put from this other deck. Sun cities. They feeling real, un real defeated at this time. Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, God, give me some more messages. Let me lay some more stage, Sun seeds. Cause I can. This energy is. Whew. Somebody, somebody just want to celebrate with you, chill with you, be your energy again. I'm hearing just celebrate, see you enjoying yourself. <laughs> somebody want to just see you enjoy yourself. That'll make this person day. Mm. Holy Spirit, give me some messages, please. And thank you. Holy Spirit, give me some more messages, please. And thank you. Yeah. 
cleanse yourself and blockages. A lot of you guys removed yourself from this energy because you felt like this person was a blockage. Yeah, arrested. If this person is not arrested, um, this could be someone who, um, you know, just feel trapped in their head, imprisonment. This could be someone who constantly goes to um, jail a lot, um, get in trouble with the authority. Or this could be just be someone that just in their head, they feeling trapped. This also could be someone that's in spiritual jail. Thank you, um, Holy Spirit. Because with the Empress in all right and the, the Emperor in reverse, somebody could be in spiritual jail for the way how they treated you. This person could be dealing with a lot of blockages. Um, this person has, with this cleanse, clenching space, I feel like whoever this person is, their energy just not real right, okay? But um, Spirit is putting this person in hermit, okay? To where they have no choice but to go within and self-reflect. Yeah, jumping to conclusion. Mirroring you. Could be a twin flame connection. But I feel like you triggered this person. The more you worked on yourself, you mirrored that back to this person. Yeah. This person has codependency issues, okay? Mm -hmm. Gratitude. This is my ancestry card. Give a lot of gratitude to your um, ancestors because whatever is going down right now, just know that your ancestors is behind everything, okay? Your ancestors is revealing some type of truth to you, something that you need to see within this person, okay? Um, it's not saying that this person is a bad person. I just have to clear it up being obedient. I'm not saying that this person is a bad person. It's just that when you was dealing with this person, Sunsees, this person was in a low vibrational energy and it just wasn't right for you at that time. Um, with the Emperor in Reverse, um, this person has the potential of being an Emperor in the Upright, which is very divine. But at this time, this person has to work on themselves so they can get to the upright. This person tried to control the situation because they thought they knew your heart, you know? With the altercation being here, I feel like this person is fighting with themselves. Phases. Um, something is um gonna um I feel like something is going to change. Okay. Something is going to change. Something is significant about the phases, the moon, the new moon, um, wax the moon. Something is going to change. And I feel like that's just the work of, you know, your ancestors is, you know, putting that work for you. And I also feel like the divine is trying to help this person because, again, like I said, I have to be obedient. This person has the potential to be a divine being in the upright. But because this person chose to operate in a low vibrational energy, this person could be in spiritual jail. We have rumors. So there was a lot of rumors being spread, okay, when it came to you. Um, maybe um, maybe um, a lot of people was gossiping about this connection. You know, this could be whoever, family, friends, or whatever. Just a lot of people had something to say. Everybody had something to say about your connection with this person. For a lot of you guys, you guys just, just decided to, you know, to keep it moving, you know, focus on yourself. Somebody is in the energy of just doing very well for themselves, getting ready for the holidays, you know, you know, just trying to get themselves in the spirit, just looking good. Just, you know, just somebody is just trying to find that love within themselves. Okay. And they doing very well. At it. A lot of you guys are not wanting for anything. And that's just only this only spirit. Just, you know, um, I'm here to reimburse you for everything that you've been through. Because you were so obedient and you decided to continue to put in the work in yourself, even when you felt like, you know, it was times where you didn't even want to get out the bed. Where it was times where this, this situation has hurted you, made you so confused that you felt like it was you. Mm-mm, baby. It was bigger. Mm-mm. Well, they say it was bigger than Nino Brown, baby. The humor. People thought it was funny. People gossip. They laugh. When this person did, when this person played games with you, been in this play of energy, See, a lot of you, um, 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 Mystic, um, Sunflower, my collective Sunseeds, a lot of you guys, you know, um, probably took this person around your family, took this person around your children. You know, you guys was very, um, very hopeful about this connection when you hooked up with this person. Um, and I feel like when things didn't go right, people that always had, you know, envious, you know, jealousy towards you, they laughed when things didn't go right because this person decided to be in this low vibrational energy. They laughed. They laughed at you. They really laughed. Cuffer season. They laughed when you was in a relationship with this person because this person was in this low... They knew this person was a player or in this low vibrational energy. But they didn't know that spirit was going to take care of them just like spirit was going to take care of you. 
Christmas. Something is very significant about Christmas. Something, and I've been saying that, right? You guys can be celebrating or getting, getting um, you know, getting your house ready or just in a Christmas spirit. But with this Christmas and cuffing season coming out both together, a lot of you guys um could be coming into union with someone around Christmas time. Obsession under the bottom. Somebody could be real. Some some of you guys can have new love. Okay, take it how it resonates. Give me one card, Holy Spirit, on this Christmas and cuffing season. Please and thank you. Yeah, guarded with life purpose. Mm. So a lot of you guys could be um, at this time right now where you just focused on yourself, um, your family, you know, your well-being. And you guys could just be focused on your life purpose. You guys could be protecting your heart when it comes to relationships. A lot of you guys with the Christmas card are understanding and knowing your worth now. Um, and you're just not about to give it to just anybody anymore. Ooh, that's a spirit bird. <laughs> um, you guys are respecting your temple, your mind, body, and your soul. Um, and you guys are just fully in your life purpose. Yeah, missing peace. But someone feels like they, yeah, missing peace and celebrating with desire. I cannot make it up. Somebody is desiring you. Somebody who sees you at a two of cups. Somebody who a soulmate connects you only has eyes for you. Somebody's felt like a major... A major piece out the heart is missing without you. So while you guys are in this energy of feeling fulfillment within yourself, somebody else is missing, you know, a major part out of them because they feel like you're gone. Yeah, the grass was fake. Somebody went somewhere and they thought, yeah, confusion. Oh, they was confused, all right? Somebody went somewhere and they realized the grass was fake. That's that devil with that night of wands. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit, what's this girl yeah, blackmail. And I get with the blackmail, it's just that intuitively sun sees, because you know I'm not just a tarot reader. I'm I'm an intuitive reader, you know. Um, with that, it just giving me somebody just thought they had it in the bag. Somebody just thought they knew how good your heart was. They just played on your sweetness, your kindness, how genuine you were, how compassionate you were. And they thought that it can just be in this energy and take advantage of you. And that's why I'm picking up on a blackmail with the emperor reverse. But spirit had another rude awakening for this person. I can't make it up. I can't make it up. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Holy Spirit. The Herman is self-reflection. Somebody thought they was somebody thought they so, see, somebody thought they had one up on you. But they ain't know. Your spirit guides was like, how dare you? How dare you? How dare you? How dare you be childish? Termination. You lost. You lost. Let me get you guys some messages from Spirit before we close this out. So let's see. Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, give me some messages from my collective sources before we close this out. Period. How dare you? How dare you? How dare you? Think you're going to play with one of my faves? This is what your ancestors and your spirit guides are saying. How dare you? One of my faves? Emotional sensitivity. Mm. Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, divine, give me some more messages. Give me some thank you. I love you, sun seeds. <clears throat> I don't mean to be, you know, hard and aggressive, but this is the energy that's being presented to me right now, and I'm just being obedient, okay? In God box. Somebody is very protected by the most high. And I'm picking up on the energy of when someone goes through things and things don't go, you know, things don't go as expected how you, you know, plan it to be. Somebody don't run to man. You know, somebody don't run to man. Somebody don't run, you know, and, and, and do low vibrational energies. Somebody runs to God. Somebody gets on their knees and they run to God. They pray a lot. They pray a lot. That's all they have. That's all they have is God. That's the only one that keeps them 10 toes up. A lot of you guys done been out here for so long 
doing your damn thing to where you don't had you don't had your foot in these people neck for so long to where your foot is stuck they know stop playing with you because it's gonna backfire every single time shield yourself it's a shield around you and they don't understand why Somebody is in a light purpose. Somebody is in a north node. Give me some more messages, Holy Spirit. Now this person wants to be your man or your woman. After realizing what they tried to plan out for you backfired tremendously. Yeah, clear yourself. Archangel Raphael. You heal, you cleared yourself and you healed yourself. I mean, it's just plain and simple. You cleared yourself and you healed yourself. Somebody was like, how did you do that so gracefully, so respectfully? I'm talking about with style and grace. You did it with the help of God. God is your source. God is your everything. You are all gods and goddesses. Anyone that's divine and watch my child, you all know that. You are all gods and goddesses. You know the power that you have within you to overcome adversity, to manifest whatever you want in this life. But you're also aware that you're nobody else's God. There's only one God. Crystals. Somebody is a healer. Somebody is a healer. It took nothing for them to heal themselves with the help of the divine because that's what they do for a living. Mm. One more call, Holy Spirit. Please and thank you. Somebody played with the wrong one, Sun Seeds, and now your person is receiving tremendously karma. Holy Spirit, one more. We have workshops and seminars. A lot of you guys are speakers or being called to be speakers. Um, a lot of you guys could do something within, uh, you know, um, with communication. You can speak to others or maybe you guys are just a speaker in your community or to your family. You get great advice. You're a great healer. Um, you're an earth angel that come to this, you know, this 3D to teach people about what love is, you know, um, you have a lot of morals and integrity and you stand on that. Someone has a very, very healing energy about them. It's something involving their hands and the way how this, the arms are. You guys can give a hug that can literally heal a person. You guys could put your hand on a person that can literally heal a person. We have the laws of attraction. Someone is a powerhouse manifester and we have ear shockers. Somebody is a very intuitive very intuitive into into intuitive i'm sorry intuitive thank you spirit um and when i crack the deck i have archangel michael and goddess i can't make it up to you guys you're very protected somebody is a goddess you guys are what i just said you guys are goddesses and kings somebody realize who they are they do they know that they're they're nobody else's god but somebody knows the power that they have within them. This person played with the wrong one. But I promise you, you put every last one of the checks on the boy and check me. This goddamn person. And they don't learn nothing in this lifetime. <laughs> I bet you they'd be cautious the next time when they run across the goddess or a god. Period. 